Hey guys, Wobboy here, and uh, I want to make this video just in case I disappear or vanish for uh, a month or something like that, just in case. Uh, if I do, then this video we will explain why, and I wanted to make it now just to address it, uh, to get it out of the way. Uh, I'm just making this because a couple things have been happening with uh, my family and all this. Nothing bad, nothing bad. Uh, uh, Thursday afternoon, uh, somewhere between 3 to 4 o'clock, my aunt... Uh, my mom's younger sister had a stroke, and uh, she had to go to the hospital, and she, she's currently in the hospital as of right now, about an hour, an hour and a half away from there. I went to visit her twice in a matter of 24 hours, so it was basically, it was like a five hour drive there and back round trip in a matter of 24 hours. Uh, she's doing very well. The uh, doctor said it was just a minor stroke, and uh, they had to run some tests and all of that, and I guess they found that she has like two holes in her heart from, they said the, the, the stroke. Uh, that what caused the stroke is she ha it was like from caused from her birth defect and when she was born she was born with a cleft lip and uh, I don't know what I mean I'm I've seen a cleft lip before because her son my cousin how was also born with a cleft lip so that was just a birth defect and that's what made what well, reason why uh, personally I thought it would just be because we're stressed and all that but they said the doctor said that's like at the very bottom of it of uh, what of what causes it. it can but it's right there at the bottom. And uh, I wanted to point this out as well. Uh, since August, I had many, many panic attacks, and I always felt like something was wrong. I felt like I was having a stroke for some reason, and uh, of course, somebody ends up having a stroke in my family. Me and my mom were actually talking about that because she believes that, like, she doesn't believe in uh, telepathic or future fortune teller things. But apparently, a lot of the stuff that I felt like or said uh, what was going to happen, it was going to happen. So. I never thought about it like that until she explained it because after this, you know, but I don't know, I was just thinking about it, I was very, very scared or scared and shock and uh, about it. I wanted to go up there, my mom went up there like three times and I already went up there like two times, so, and uh, I don't know if we're going to go back or not, but the way that things are looking, she may be home, back here home tomorrow afternoon or something, and, um, but... It was very scary, and I'm like, oh wow, well, what's crazy about it, because she's my mom's younger sister, very, very close, close to me, and a very supporter of my future, and basically just a big supporter of me in general, and uh, what's crazy about it, she's really younger than my mom, my mom's 44, or going to be turning 44, and my aunt is uh, 30, uh, 34, and uh, she's only 13 years younger than me, which is absolutely crazy, and I'm like, wow, and then she has, of course, two boys, really young boys, and her oldest son was more so born with a cleft lip. And so they said that he may have something like that in the future. He could have, he can, he may not. He, he just got to have the way in the future and all that. So, and the reason I'm making this is to address that. And another reason is that um, they may, apparently she has to be watched more often now for, for about a month or so. So uh, she may have to come here, come here to live with us. Uh, or stay so we can watch her and help with the boys and all with her ch ch with her boys and all that as well and because they go to school here in the same town where I went to school at and it's just basically right across the street and uh, so I wanted to address that just in case if that does happen uh, I probably won't make videos because they're loud they're rambunctious they cause a riot majority of the time stay so they happen like that when they first moved here because they moved here from Georgia Georgia, they go, she goes around, she will stay here for a couple of years, and then she'll move to Kansas, then she'll move to Georgia, and then back here, so she moved back here, when she first moved back, when she first moved here to Georgia, she moved in with us, let us, let, we let her stay for a couple of months, and then she went to find her own place, and then, she's not moving back in, but, she may, we say she, somebody has to watch her, to say the least, so, um, I just wanted to address that to let everybody know what's going on, just in case, so, and if something does happen, I'll give it a couple of days, I'll give probably till the middle of the week to address it, something, if you don't see another video of me by that, then this video explains why, so, um, hopefully everything will get sorted out soon in the future, uh, what else to say, I think it's pretty much the video, so, um, who knows what would happen, maybe they'll figure something out, and you know she'll be able to come back, go back home on her own. So um, hopefully they'll be able, we'll be able to work everything out. So, like I said, I wanted to address this to explain what would happen just in case I vanish for a month or something like that. So this will be why. So I'm gonna give it until Wednesday. So, yeah, I'm gonna either gonna give it until Tuesday or Wednesday, or Saturday. So I'm gonna give it until then. If you don't see a video by me either, but probably by Wednesday, and then they probably. 
sense, and that's what I wrote. That's why. So, I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys a lot for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you hit that thumbs up, comment, subscribe. I'll see you all in a future video. Take it easy.